15 years ago, I would have thought that I would be in medical school. I was rifling through the newspaper and I came across an advertisement. Um, Royal Brunei Airlines needed engineers and I had to sort of rethink my career path. The engineering world was known to be a male-dominant industry and as RB's chief engineer, I'm pleased to throw that outdated statement out of the aircraft window. RB's engineering department has employed over 70 women and where half is directly involved with maintenance. I consider myself very fortunate to have this opportunity as this apprenticeship was the perfect balance between theory and practical. Everyone in the engineering department, they have been very welcoming and they have taught me a lot of things that would have proven to be very useful. It is quite a challenge for us as a woman. Some may not believe in you, some may have doubt on you, but you just have to believe in yourself. It is about having passion, determination, drive, and skill that counts. Especially to uh, those young females out there who want to pursue a career in engineering, work hard for it. Do study hard, be confident, take pride in what you do, and remember that you are working as a team and you are not alone. For this year's International Women in Engineering Day, I would like to celebrate each and every woman out there on the hangar floor and offices. You all have helped shape the world by making RB recognize and the importance of diversity and inclusion in engineering. Happy International Women in Engineering Day to all of you and all women engineers around the world. If you give up, if you don't try, then you will never know. And if someone dares tell you that you can't do it, you should turn around and say, watch me, and prove them wrong. <laughs>